Last round six to two. Has a 10-4 lead as we begin round number three here in this lightweight battle. 60 kilograms between Frankie Gavin and Ramal Amanov of Azerbaijan. Amanov has clawed back to the border of being in this. But not able to capitalize on Gavin moving straight back. You have a guy going back against the ropes. You have a chance to score. But he's down seven now. That was a shoulder butt that came up. Will they call him on that or just another warning? Another warning. That was a, a frustration. And there was another one. Well, he is tempting the fate. Usually what they'll do is it will be repeated offenses of the same nature will lead to the penalty. And that's Amanov is going, around the, is going around with a tour here. He's, try, he's gotten away with different offenses. Both men being sent to their corners. And we resume action. Gavin in the red, Amanov in the blue. One man moving on to the round of eight. Continue to grind it on the inside, but for Amanov now, time becoming significantly important. Final minute of the third round. And down by seven. When he's only scored six. So he has to make up a mountain's worth of work here. He'd have about 60 points if he was fighting air in addition to Gavin because he's caught a lot of that. <laughs> Uh, he's had the ability, and finally we do have an infraction, and yet it's Gavin who gets penalized after Amanov has been on the border of being penalized a number of times. Ramal Amanov getting two points for the infraction against Frankie Gavin. Gavin in the red, Amanov in the blue. Here at the 2007 AIBA World Boxing Championships. Round of 16. And that is the end of round number three in what has certainly not been necessarily a work of art. Now with the two lefties. We've seen this. It was better than the other match with the two lefties because these guys are not afraid to throw the leather. Unfortunately for them, it's been a clash of the styles. 15-8 in a match that's not scintillating shows, I think, how far the computer scoring has come because it accurately reflects what's going on. to be frustrating for both both fighters both left-handers not to be able to necessarily pull off their their bout plan so to speak but because you have, of their relative awkwardness you have the advantage against a lot of boxers being a lefty in that they don't they don't like fighting the lefties and that advantage has disappeared and this still has been a better bout than most lefty versus lefties Fourth and final round. Only one man will advance. And right now, Frankie Gavin, that man, if about ended at this moment, 17-9, he leads Ramal Amanov of Azerbaijan. And there's the shoulder butt again by Amanov that's not called. And from that perspective, it's a good thing this is not a two-point fight because Gavin 
has been penalized for doing a lot less. And Amanov has done a number of things that have been improper and not had anything happen. Gavin's mouthpiece goes flying, and I don't think it was necessarily because of a punch. Gavin, 22 years old, his opponent, 24 years old, Amanov from Azerbaijan. Final minute of this fourth and final round. We have a decision in ring B in the 60 kilogram weight class. Frankie doing what he has to do to uh, ensure victory, and that is stay away from Amanov. And 10 points with 40 seconds to go. Is as huge a margin as you would ever need here. Way more than enough. And Amanov has really preoccupied himself with how many tricks he can get away with. He has scored 10 points. He's unleashed about 15 infractions. And he keeps trying for something off the books rather than trying to find a scoring combination. So the frustration has really set in on Amanov. Combination of both frustration and just the usual outcomes when two left-handers get together. 21-10 here in the final seconds of this lightweight match between Frankie Gavin and Ramal Amanov of Azerbaijan. And that'll do it, 21-10 is the way it will go into the books. Gavin is moving on to the next round. In what can best be described as a, an awkward bout between two left-handers. It was sloppy in many regards, but Frankie what? Gavin bought his heart, and he's going into the round of eight. And if you have to win five or six bouts to win a championship, you have to figure that you have to get have by one, maybe two, that won't be in pretty. The weight class, the winner in the red corner, let's let's not forget one, that Frankie in many Gavin. cases, these are just young kids. Frankie Gavin, just 22 years old from Birmingham, England, looking to become a member of England's Olympic team, hoping to get a ticket to Beijing, but even more important, hoping to win maybe a world championship here in Chicago. Frankie Gavin, your winner, 21-10. Or is a miserable word. Or makes you choose. Or is a bore. And is different.